We have to stop treating the opposition like they're a legitimate party and start treating them like the death cult they are. Once you are so brainwashed that you'll kill yourselves and your children to make a point, that you'll give up law and order just to see your enemies get hurt and your heroes win, once you're willing to give up democracy and the right to vote to make sure your team stays on top or don't care about the long-term health of the planet you live on or the species you yourselves are part of, then you are lost. This is not normal. It is a cult and we have to start dealing with it as such. We need to talk to people who have safely extracted people from cults. We need the insight of ex-cult members. We can't just pretend it isn't happening. How many American lives have been lost? What else could cause this much American devastation and have us do nothing to fight it? If we don't start acknowledging reality, our healthcare system is going to implode. Our education system is going to collapse. There will be fighting in the streets. Americans will die at the hands of other Americans. And maybe that's exactly what the cult leaders want. Complete destruction of the country so they can build it back the way they want it. But we can't just allow that to happen. We need to shut it down. Start with the source of the lies that feeds the fear and anger of its members. Find, sue, or remove these propaganda networks from the airways in the name of American health and well-being. They are taking worm pills for livestock. They're clearly being led down a path. Shut down these rallies in the name of public safety because they are race-baiting violent powder kegs that are causing domestic terrorists to threaten lawmakers and plant bombs in buildings. Regulate and fine social media companies who allow the spread of disinformation in the name of profit to the detriment of human safety and national security. If you need money to do this, take it from the defense budget. That money is supposed to protect us from enemies foreign and domestic. And our biggest enemies are all here. Finally, shore up our voting rights or we will be stuck being ruled by this death cult simply because we allowed them to cheat their way to power and they never gave it back. This is an invasion and the intruders are already in the house. So what are we going to do about it?